Hi everyone, long time no see. Um, mainly because I've been busy, which is strange for me. But yeah, I'm teaching at university now. I'm officially a tutor. I'm tutoring third year psych students, so that's fun. And for the last two weeks, I've been marking 67 essays, uh, 2,500 words each. So I did the maths a little bit and found that I've read a Harry Potter's book worth of essays, which is always fun. Anyway, I'm not here to talk about Harry Potter or essays. I'm here to talk about the wonderful Brisbane Skepta Camp, which is a bit of a mouthful. Um, so obviously, if you are not in Australia, or if you do not have millions of dollars in which you can use your money however you like and fly to Brisbane for a one-day event, then obviously this has nothing to do with you. But keep listening anyway to the dulcet tones of my voice. Uh, Skepta Camp in Brisbane on Saturday the 19th of July. I will be presenting. Yay! I mean, I don't know why they don't have it on their website that Holly of Fear Blandness fame is presenting. <laughs> No, it's an open forum uh, little speech thingy, I guess, where you just sign up to do a 20 minute speech about something. Oh, hello, cat. Um, <laughs> about something. Ah, get off. All right, take two, sans cat. So, Skepta Camp, 19th of July in Brisbane, I will be presenting. Uh, it's basically just a collection of skeptical minded people. Uh, who wish to listen to other sceptically minded people. Uh, I will be doing my speech on my thesis research, uh, which was about detecting deception and reading facial expressions. And I'll basically just be informing everyone that humans are pretty stupid sometimes when it comes to detecting lies. So we have to be extra careful when it comes to... Um, bogus claims thrown out there about various things that we have to really put on our skeptical glasses because to begin with we're not good at picking up on lies or um, deception to do with theory of mind. Uh, all that is covered in a recent article that I wrote for um, the ABC um, which I was very proud of. So if you cannot make it to Skept Camp, which I'm guessing 99.999% of you can't, seeing as though you're probably in America or overseas somewhere, you can read my article, which I will put down in the description. However, if you can make it to Brisbane on Saturday the 19th of July, uh, you'll be treated to a day full of, uh, I'm guessing, excellent speeches, because one of them will be mine. Um about sceptical and scientific issues and it'll be hosted by the lovely Jake Farwharton who I have um, featured on his podcast uh, The Imaginary Friends Show uh, and talked about a little bit here on YouTube and a lot on Twitter. He will be hosting um, and recording a podcast I believe but I might be wrong so don't hold me to that. Anyway it will be a great event and I'm pretty sure that they are filming it so regardless of whether you can come or not I can direct you to a video of my speech, uh, which I'm hoping will go well and I will not fall flat on my face. Metaphorically, it's hard to fall flat on your face when you're in a wheelchair. Um, yeah, other than that, I just thought I would update you all on what I've been doing. Uh, still working on my PhD, which is code for haven't touched my PhD in a few months, which is very naughty, but I'm having writer's block but not the creative, airy-fairy kind, just the don't really want to start it because it's scary kind. And if I put it off for long enough, maybe it will just disappear. And maybe in three years, I'll just get my PhD and without having done anything. Anyway, hope you're all doing well. Um, as always, probably best to follow me on Twitter as that is where I usually am. Um, I do realise my Fear Blandness Facebook page has gone a bit dead, but that has been because I've been reading a Harry Potter's book worth of essays and just doing life, I suppose. But yeah, thanks for listening. If you can make it to Skepta Camp, that would be fantastic. If you do, come up and say hello. Um, I would be very pleased and looking forward to seeing any of you there if you can make it if you live near Brisbane. Uh, I'll also put all the details of Skepticamp um, in the description. 
hopefully you can make it. And if not, just be there in spirit. Thanks, guys.